Ooh. Hey guys, it's Natasha here. Today we are gonna be making butterfly pea tea. The reason why I wanted to do this is I've been wanting to make it for a while. And on top of that, it's such a beautiful drink. And butterfly pea in general was founded more in Southeast Asia. And it's really, really popular there because of how it provides antioxidants for your body. And not just that, the drink is so beautiful with the sapphire blue color. It just makes you want to just enjoy it and have a really nice drink during the summertime. The butterfly pea in general has a very subtle earthy taste. And when it combines with the lemonade or the latte, it just evens out and makes it a really nice drink. So let's go ahead and make this beautiful drink. Time to make the syrup. And this is the butterfly pea flowers that we got from Majestic Herbs. We purchased it on Amazon for about 10 bucks, which is great. It smells really good. It's like earthy and almost a little bit sour. So we already pre-boiled the water. It's already simmering. Um, we're gonna go ahead and put in one cup of sugar inside the boiling water. And go ahead, of course, and mix it around. Let the simmer. Once you see the simmer, go ahead and cover it. Turn off the heat and then let it sit for 10 minutes. Wow, look at You can see the blue coming out already on the bottom. See that, it's beautiful. So now we are going to be making the butterfly pea lemonade. So we actually ran out of ice, but it's okay. I understand lemonade usually is really good with ice for the summer. But first we are going to actually put the butterfly pea flour into the drink. So we're going to put half of that on both of them. So I wanted to do more of a round version and then also a tall glass so we can see how beautiful it turns out. It's so gorgeous. And then we're gonna do another half for each of this as well for the lem lemonade, which we already pre-made. Wow, look how pretty that is. Ooh, that's really good. It's definitely just pure lemonade. Um, you can't really taste the butterfly pea. It's just exactly how it is, like it's very subtle. So you can't even really taste the earthiness as well, but you, it's straight up really gorgeous. It's really the perfect drink for summer. So we are gonna be making the butterfly pea latte version. So before we actually assemble everything, I am gonna go ahead and actually mix one third of half and half, one tablespoon of condensed milk. And I'm gonna go ahead and put the vanilla extract inside. So we pre-boiled this just with regular water and then added the flour in. Ooh. Wow, you see the top goes and it swirls. Look at that. Has like a mixture of colors, like white here, but then you see on the bottom it's like light blue and the top is the rich sapphire color. So pretty. Wow. Ooh. Nice. Wow, this is really good. It's really, really good. It tastes exactly like a latte, for sure. Um, you definitely will taste the half and half, the 
it really overpowers the butterfly pea. You can't really taste the butterfly pea. That's just how butterfly pea is. It's very subtle. It's just such a beautiful color to drink on a nice summer day. It's just so pretty. And the what is really good is the condensed milk makes it a, a little bit more sweeter. So if you add in ice, I'm sure that will also help lessen the sweetness too. Yum, yum, yum. The colors are brilliant. Like this is the butterfly pea lemonade. And then this is the butterfly pea latte. Look how gorgeous they are. Um, what I've learned is with lemonade with the acid, it actually makes the butterfly pea turn purple. And then of course, when we use like a cream type like milk, half and half. So it just makes the color a little bit lighter blue. So let's see a close up for both of them. It's such a perfect drink for summer, um, especially since like you can add ice in it if you like to. It's a great way to also um, make a drink with your kid during the summertime. So just add a little bit of color. Found out that you really cannot taste the butterfly pea part, but it's just a fun way to make a drink and make it beautiful and have a great day you know, enjoy your day. So thank you for watching. Please do subscribe and don't forget to turn on your notifications so then you can stay tuned for my upcoming videos. Thank you so much. Goodbye.